What do you get when the super cool meets the super inflated? Like I take this balloon and dip it into this nitrogen bath. There you go, cold, shriveled up, and we're talking about totally, completely downsized to nothing. But what's even cooler is what happens when I pull it out and let it warm back up. Your brain warmed up yet? Try this. These are Tennessee meat goats, and they're not just ordinary goats. They've got some weird behavior characteristics caused by a genetic mutation. What do you think their first response to fear is gonna be? They actually faint. So how does that work? They carry a hereditary gene called myotonia congenita, and that jittery little gene causes their muscles to stiffen up when they get startled and they fall over in a dead faint. All right, so what do you think's gonna happen to our shrunken balloon now that we've taken it out of the deep freeze? The transfer of heat from the air molecules in the balloon to the super chilly nitrogen robs the air of some of its energy. So, the air molecules inside the balloon huddle up together in a much smaller space, otherwise known as shrinkage. But when the liquid nitrogen starts to warm up, the energy flows back the other way. The air molecules get all active again and take up the space that they occupied before, and that reinflates the balloon. Science in action.